I know most of my subscribers love hydrogen technology, so I try to stay up to date on the latest news and updates in the world of hydrogen engines, cars and even production. Well today I have a cool new video brought to you from the geniuses at WAE Technologies. Now WAE Technologies, formerly known as Williams Advanced Engineering, just a year after introducing the groundbreaking all-electric EVR platform, a rolling chassis intended for racing have taken a remarkable leap forward with the EVR H platform, a hydrogen fuel cell alternative that is poised to revolutionize the industry, designed for third-party manufacturers eager to put a green supercar on the road. The EVR H platform offers unparalleled performance, sustainability and versatility. At the heart of the EVRH platform is its innovative hydrogen fuel cell system, a quantum leap from traditional gasoline or battery powered vehicles. Instead of relying on conventional power sources, it capitalizes on the chemical reaction between hydrogen and oxygen to generate electricity powering the vehicle seamlessly. The energy produced is stored in a high-tech liquid-cooled fuel cell electric vehicle battery pack capable of impressively rapid charging at rates of up to 120 kilowatts. What sets the EVRH apart is its robust power output, boasting a staggering 430 kilowatt, equivalent to 577 horsepower. This abundant energy allows for blistering acceleration, catapulting the vehicle to 62 in less than 2.5 seconds. Now, when racing, range is also really important. I mean, you want to spend as much time on track as possible. Between refuels, which by the way takes less than 5 minutes in one of these. As for range, 372 miles or 600 kilometers is what you get, making it suitable for both long journeys and thrilling track racing experiences. That's of course if you have hydrogen to fill it up with. But there is more to race cars and even supercars than just power. WAE Technologies has gone the extra mile to optimize the EVRH's performance. The fuel tank and battery system are strategically placed in the center of the car ensuring an ideal weight distribution. This configuration enhances its handling. To add to this and make the car handle even better, one of the key innovations of the EVRH platform is its lightweight composite tub. This engineering marvel empowers automakers to use this platform as a base to create vehicles that weigh less than 1,900 kilograms. Now, 1,900 kilograms may sound like a lot, and it is, but all electric and fuel cell vehicles tend to be heavy. But in the world of fuel cell and EV races, this reduction in weight translates to exceptional agility and responsiveness, placing EVRH powered supercars in a league of their own. Now, for OEMs and other companies interested in buying one of these chassis, the EVRH platform offers the choice of all-wheel drive or rear-wheel drive systems, catering to the diverse needs of manufacturers. Irrespective of the drivetrain, the central tub's design accommodates both hardtop and targa configurations. Furthermore, WAE Technologies has meticulously crafted the EVRH to maximize the potential of active aerodynamics, ensuring optimal performance both on-road and track. In fact, thanks to the lightweight tub, its ability to integrate multiple motors and its potential for advanced aerodynamic systems, WAE Technologies predicts that a vehicle based on the EVRH platform can complete a lap of the iconic Nürburgring circuit in as little as 7 minutes and 20 seconds, a feat akin to the legendary Ferrari 488 GTB's performance in 2016. Now, as I have said, this platform can be built for use in both track-only and road-legal vehicles. It offers an expedited pathway to production for automakers seeking to push the boundaries of performance and sustainability. The remarkable similarity between the EVR and the EVRH platforms enables third-party companies to develop both all-electric and hydrogen-powered models concurrently broadening the scope of innovation in the supercar market, and I think WAE will find a lot of success in these projects. So let's end it off. In an era where sustainability and high performance coexists, WAE Technologies EV RH platform emerges as a beacon of hope. It combines the thrill of rapid acceleration, the benefit of hydrogen fuel cell technology, and the potential for groundbreaking aerodynamics to create a driving experience unlike any other. Whether on the open road or on the racetrack, the EVRH is said to leave an indelible mark on the automotive industry, offering a tantalizing glimpse into future supercars. But let me know what you guys think. Um, for me personally, I'll have to be honest, I like internal combustion engines, and I know technically they are slower in a straight line because 
electric vehicles just have instant torque and their torque vectoring is just like on another level. So in a straight line, an electric vehicle with even the same power as an indoor combustion engine vehicle would win the race every single time. But for me, the character, the vibrations, the feel of a true internal combustion engine just makes it a better car straight off the bat. But I do have to say, there are people that just like speed and this gives them an extra option. I mean, fully electric is cool and all for how fast they are. But when you go to a track, you want to spend every single second going around said track. So with the hydrogen fuel cell car, you can just like refuel the hydrogen in five minutes and get back on track. Where with the electric, you have to spend, let's say, 45 minutes to recharge and then you're back on track, race a bit, come back, 45 minutes. So your off time is just much more with a fully electric. Where with this system, you can actually spend a hell of a lot of time on track. But yeah. At the end of the video, please let me know what you guys think. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you did like it, you must remember to like most of my other stuff. So just go through my channel, see if there's something else you like. I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers, I. My heart rages around like an ocean.